I like the S7 program. This is the home of the symbol table. To open, double click symbols. Scroll to the bottom of the symbol table. A new level switch has been added to the process. The device ID is LSH1110 and is wired to input 1.4. Click the empty cell in the symbol column. Type the symbol name LSH-1110 and press the tab key. You'll notice that the address field increments whatever's before it by one. If this is not what you want, just replace it. Type the address I1.4 and press the tab key again. You'll see that the program adds the data type bool. You can add a comment in the comment column. Let's add a symbol name, T-O-N, and press the tab key. You'll see that the name turns pink with red lettering, indicating that the name already exists. It also highlights the duplicate symbol name. One of these will have to be corrected or deleted so that every name is unique. We will delete this one. Let's add another symbol name. We'll call this one Start Belt. At input address 8.4. Now the address turns pink, indicating that I8.4 already has another symbol name. Let's scroll up the list. And there's the other symbol name. We'll delete this one. and save the symbol table. Let's modify the name VAT1, which stands for Variable Table 1, to BIO list. The name is now changed and we'll save the symbol table. This concludes adding or modifying a symbol name in the symbol table.